You have probably all heard about how AI or artificial intelligence is changing the world around us, and now AI could impact breast cancer detection with every mammogram. Here's Eyewitness News anchor Liz Cho. And it gives you that red box right there. You are looking at the future of mammography. This new artificial intelligence program that reads mammograms has only been used for about two months at Murray Hill Radiology, but it could make a massive impact on how breast cancers are found. AI mammography is a specialized computerized program that helps to uh, find breast cancers on the screen and helps radiologists guide them to areas of specific concern. It's been trained using a million images of the breast and it's been trained on 8,000 biopsy proven breast cancers. Right after a patient is screened, their mammogram goes into a computer program and an algorithm takes about eight minutes to process. Using the million images in its database, the AI marks areas on the mammogram as high, medium, or low concern. Medical studies have shown that using AI mammography increases the breast cancer detection rate of about 20% without having to do any additional imaging, additional uh, biopsies, uh, there aren't any increased false positives. And another benefit to this new computer program, the fact that it's not human. AI mammography is like having another set of expert eyes looking at the mammogram, and it's eyes that don't get tired or distracted. But it is still up to a human radiologist to decide how to follow up on areas of concern. Dr. Baskin says patients still need the personal type of care a computer could never give, but they are embracing this new technology. With increasing the detection of breast cancer, which this does, you're saving lives. Very excited about the potential of this. I think it's a great tool. I really find it to be very useful, and uh, I think it's going to be all positive for patients in terms of early detection for breast cancer. Our programming special Breakthroughs for Breast Cancer airs this Sunday at 530 and it is hosted by Liz Cho.